Dykes on the beat. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and if you're new how I'm seeing and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys basically how I label and get my clothes ready to be packaged to go to you guys who have ordered from me so basically I'm going to show you guys how I take it from the box put them onto my little clothing rack label them all the other good stuff so everything in this box is what I use I have these um, little like things to go on the hanger so I know what size they are I have a tagging gun which most of the stuff is from Uline or Amazon as you can see so this is just me putting my dresses on the hangers. I have pant hangers and clothing hangers for my clothes. And then I put the size markers onto the hanger so that I know when it comes time to tag it what size it is. And this is basically all I'm gonna be doing for like the next few seconds of this clip. And so once I'm done with that process, this is how everything looks with the sizes and the clothes all hung up and put together. So this is like my pre-process before I go into doing this part, which I have the extension, I think is what they call, on my Shopify um, store, which is the label extension, I believe. I don't know the exact name. I'll try to put it on the screen if I can remember. But I basically just clip whatever clothing I want. I press print. Um, oh yeah, it's barcode labels print barcode labels and then sometimes I have to actually go in and like create barcodes for the items if I don't do that in the beginning which it does not take that long as you'll see it takes like two seconds <laughs> but after I do that I go back in search the products again click them I click that I want to make labels for each item that I have in stock so you see I have two small two medium one large I make two small labels two medium labels and then two large labels and then with this you have to actually make like templates which i didn't go into detail because it's not that hard but as you can see i have a few different templates so i use the one for clothing because of course i am tagging my clothing and then after that i just go ahead and i print the labels and i use my actual label printer that i used to print out my um shipping labels my packaging slips i just get a certain uh, <laughs> i just get a certain size for them so as you can see now my printer printer is printing them i have a label range printer which i will be doing a packaging video with me soon just i need to get stuff straight out before i go do that again but here are my hang tags they're the first one that i ever made i'll be making some more once these run out but i had ordered like 500 <laughs> so i'm just going to keep using these so basically the process for me tagging them is i put it onto the tag gun and then i take the clothes where it has like a little line a crease i don't know what how to explain it but i put it there tag it put it through and then that is how it looks and i just go ahead and tag all the clothes using this gun And so this is how everything looks once I finish tagging all the clothes. This right here is my jumpsuits. If you have not watched my try on haul, I tried on most of these clothes. And so here's all the tags, the In Your Dreams jumpsuit and then the expensive taste dresses. So now I'm just looking at the size tags and then just taking that certain size tag and putting it onto the clothing tag so that everything matches and everything, you know, is correct. So basically that's all I'm doing in this clip. And 
and this is how everything looks completed with the label and the actual tags on the clothes which i like it i just know next time that i make my tags i'm going to make them more of a glossy tag and also not have just have one side with my logo on and then the other side blank just to make everything simple for me but this is how everything basically looks once completed and i am going to show you guys one more time which i'm showing you with the moose wings dress <music> Actually, here you can see where I messed up because there was no barcode on the actual label but I didn't notice that until after I kind of like came back well this place right here is where no oh I, I cut out the clip but anyway I had messed up so I had to redo it and reprint it so they actually had a label up there and now I'm showing you guys my tags up close like I said the next time I make them I'm not going to have that up there hang tag from Amazon I'll try to link everything down below my my tagging gun is from Amazon along with the um the whatever things it's called but everything else is from uline so yeah so i'm just fast forwarding through it because i'm just showing you guys so hopefully you enjoyed this video and you learned some things from it if you did like comment and subscribe if you have any questions comment them down below and hopefully i will see you guys in my next video and this is sand signing off peace Thanks, it's on the beat.